Hi guys, welcome back to The Journeyman and welcome back to, uh, fuck, where are we? Final. <laughs> fuck it. <laughs> we're in Final. Of course we're in Final. What am I about? As you can see, I've not really been doing too well. Been struggling. Been struggling. So, I still can't believe we lost fucking 4-0 to Excelsior. So obviously, we beat RPL 4-0 and then played Excelsior, lost 4-0. Uh... Played FC Twente, lost 2 0. Played Barcelona. We've done all right actually. Um I wouldn't I would argue that a four two away loss against Barcelona with the team we've got isn't that bad at all. One all against VVV. Really pissed me off that did. Really pissed me off. And we beat Heracles 2 0, Utrecht 2 0. We do have a game, it's a no reason game against RBL now. So as you can see, we are out of the Champions League. Uh, <coughs> pardon me. I think we do get a second crack at Europe with the Europa League. Um, but we'll see how things go there. So we've got SLB and then we've got Addo Den Haag. Um, those are the two games we've got today. So if we go to the squad for today's match, and let's go to the tactics. As you can see, Jose Guy has got himself suspended like a fucking moron. Um, I think that was a collection of yellow cards. Flanagan's also got himself a yellow card. Fellaini got himself sent off in the league, so he, he's got some uh, he's, he's got he's got some missed matches coming up soon. Always always nice. Um, just being him in real life, I guess. But as you can see here, we've I've, I've, I've put in this new tactic here, and this is the tactic we used against Barcelona. Um, should we should we go for it? Should we try the strikeless tactic? Or should we go for what I've been calling elsewhere the Sigurd Hring? Because this is the tactic I used in the stream, the Twitch stream, with the Swedish team, AFC Eskilstuna. You know what, I think we're going to stick with this. Actually, no, fuck it. It's Benfica, it's a no reason game. Let's just do this, let's go with this. We've got Sabali, I think, so. Who's the, who have I got set up on the... I'm sure Sabali's one of the tyres I want to get rid of. I might be wrong. No, it's Bergheis. Bergheis is one of the players I want to get rid of. Um, in other news, we've got, before we hurry on, Mikel Duland is on his way out. So we signed him for, how much did we sign him for? 450k, we're selling him for 900. It's not a bad shout, is it? Uh, we've also got, we go to transfers, Liam Henderson coming in. So, obviously he's another one of our ex-Celtic players. He's not brilliant, but I think we're paying like 58k total. For a free guy who's worth 825, it's, it's got to mean something, hasn't it? It's, it's, it's determination to free his work rate's 12. The thing is, he, we can turn him over. We can turn him over, and make some money out of him. That's that's why we brought him in. Anyway, let's try this uh, this strikeless tactic, shall we? See how this works out. Because all the kid, all the cool kids. I don't know if you know if you if you've watched the football manager um, regularly, you might know this. But all the cool kids do strikeless tactics. They do. They do. Um, so I figured I'd try it. I figured I'd give it a go. With this striker's tactic, although I didn't download it directly, I did have a look at two or three others online, and then worked out a tactic that kind of fit what we've got. So it's it's an interesting one, to say the least. So let's carry on. We've got a new, got a new assistant manager as well. I got rid of Vink. I had enough of Vink, so we got in John Whitney. Um, I'll show you John Whitney in a minute. He's he looks fairly decent, to be honest. Um, what should we go with? Let's go over calm. Let's go out there and carry on. Uh, avenge. There we go. It doesn't really matter, does it? To be calm, there's a lot more to come from you. Calm. I want you to get us control. Oh, fuck it. Just carry on. It's fine. I'll skip this shit. So, as I say, this is a no, no point game for us, apart from us trying out this tactic, seeing how it works. Now the players have had a few weeks to get used to it in training, obviously, a bit of familiarity there. Hopefully, it's going to work pretty damn well. And if it does work pretty damn well, we'll try it out in the next match as well against Addo Den Haag. I mean, we might as well. We've got to switch things up now and then. So we've had four. We had four. They've had no shots on on goal yet. We've had four within fucking eight minutes. 
not bad with a counter attack. I was about to give a team talk, but there's a highlight. Come on, boys, switch that ball forward. Is this a counter attack? It's got to be a counter attack. I don't know, it might not be. Fucking stop dicking around, get the ball. <laughs> get Frida. The Chalel Get Frida. Uh, I think he's one of our youth players I promoted from the reserve team. I'm not 100% sure. Uh, let's have a quick gander, shall we? He is. With a termination of 15 and work rate 12, he has potential. That's why we promote him. He doesn't really get much game time, though. I'll see if I can push him a little bit more. I've uh, got another highlight. I was going to give a team talk, but I won't bother. Come on, boys. Let's, let's see if this tactic will work out for us. Because I'm, 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 I'm struggling a little bit with the tactic that we were using. I think, I think the AI has just decided that it knows how to deal with it these days. So if we can have a different tactic, switch it up a little bit, that'd be quite, quite helpful. Come on, let's make it two 0 Eh, or not? Get a team talk going in. Let's get a calm push forward. I like, I like a calm push forward. I don't like a razor though, quite clearly. I've just caught myself in the fucking camera. Yeah, I need I need a shave. I need a good shave. So can we nick this ball, boys? Nick this ball. Simone Zaza. I'm I'm worried about the Zaza. Obviously this as I say, it's not a match we desperately need to win. In fact it's not a match we need to win at all. Uh it's just been nice to get a good result. Good result. That's what it's about. Go on, get. Oh, I thought Gatorade was going to get on the end of it again there. So what's happened today? What's happened today? I've had a migraine all day. I've got a migraine now. But I'm dealing. I'm dealing with. It. I'm dealing with it just about. I'm trying to uh, get this recorded because I've got nothing, nothing coming out this week. Otherwise, I don't think I'm going to have the time to do it either. Oh, Gatorade is going to get sent off here, isn't he? Oh fuck, he's going to get sent off. No, oh, thank fuck for that. Oh, thank fuck for that. Yeah, so I've had a, a migraine all day. I get them quite a lot of migraines. I'm not a fan. Not a fan. If you get migraines, I just, just trust me, I, I share your pain. And if you're... Hello, we've got... We've got a man, one man advantage. They've just had a player sent off. It's always nice to see. Assertive, tighten up. There we go. It's a body with a nice long range of it. Um, yeah, so if you get migraines and you're a driver like I am, and when I say a driver I don't mean just pot around to the shops in the car I mean I'm an actual professional driver um, migraines aren't a good thing because, well, it's no way of dealing with them, they just get worse especially especially, right, when you get tunnel vision and double vision when you get a migraine which I quite often do yeah, you can't, you can't drive with that uh, fortunately I managed it enough today but that didn't happen. It's just it's been a bit of a struggle. That's all. But I need to get this done. I want to get this done too. So, but with me, the migraines can last two to three days. So if there is a little bit of lapse in content this week, I can only apologise. I can only apologise. Um, let's have a look. Saying that, talking about things going on this week. I'm going to have this go out on Tuesday the Tuesday the 8th. Yeah, Tuesday the 8th. No, no. I'll, I'll bring it out a day earlier. So I'll have this come out on Monday the 7th. And then on Tuesday the 8th itself, I'll do a stream. So tomorrow, I'll, I'll be doing a stream. Or today, because some people might be watching this the following day. Um, so obviously, I don't know if you can. If you look at my channel art, you'll see the the Twitch account name. So if you do fancy coming along and watching Yes Girls doing a save live, <coughs> oh, pardon me. Then of course, please do, please do. It's always appreciated. Uh, it'd be nice to chat to some of the guys who have been watching my content and supporting me. I do appreciate it from you guys. Um, and then you can help me figure out what the fuck is going on with the team. We're not doing well. We need, we need a good. It's a bit like this here. We need just we just need some run of results. Now it's a decent goal there from Asensio. I, I, I still think he's the the best signing we've made for the last couple of seasons. 
Fuck. <laughs> Jardel. Cunt. That's his new name. Gonna fucking where is he? So Jardel. Set nickname. Cunt. I mean, it doesn't really matter. It's a, it's a goal that's not going to cause me any issues. We, we've probably won the game at this point. But it's a pointless game to win. You know? 26 shots compared to their four. We've only scored two. You're fucking kidding. We need we need to work on finishing. We need we need to find someone who's a bit more clinical uh, with their end product. Anyway, uh, yeah, I think you've shut up a lot of people. I've had some nice things said about our games recently, so we need to get it no. Rent us off. Yeah, they like to they like the rent off one. 27 shots, 63 percent possession. We only won two one against 10 men. We do need to work on some a uh, bit more clinical finishing. So we received 1.29 million. That's not a bad thing, I guess. Let's praise Gertrude. Well done, mate. Well done. See, he's going to be a good player. He's going to be a good player. I was about to say, if his determination stays good, it's gone down. And his work rate stays at a decent, decent pace, he'll become a good player for us. Anyway, let's have a quick look at uh, our assistant manager, Mr. Whitney. Not bad at all, really. Not bad at all. Obviously, man management 13, player ability 13, player potential 13, but overall, pretty fucking good. One of the better ones I could find. Um, it's facts. Let's go to training. Uh, I don't know. There we go. Yeah, that'll do. So, our next match is Addo Den Haag. Should we? Uh, yeah. Just scout a few players as well. We've got we've got the um the transfer window coming up soon. Um so hopefully we can hopefully we can shift on some players. Like I say, I'm looking to get rid of where is he? Steve Steven Berghois. Now he looks alright. But he doesn't really play. So we get we'll get shot of him. Um who was the other one? Gustafsson? No, I wanna hold on to him, he's a decent backup. I can't remember who the other person was now. Roberta's gonna go. Yeah, Roberta's gonna go. Let's get him offered to clubs. Just just find yourself a club, mate. And we'll get you in the under twenty one squad or the reserve squad. Got no no need for you. Um pretty much everyone else here is staying here. Mycel Jorgensen. Again, he's a player who doesn't play a lot. He's worth eight million, and he's on thirty k a week. I think it's worth trying to shift. Not got much transfer budget. We're over our wage budget, but then if you look at the players we've got and some of their contracts, you'll see why. John Flanagan's on seventy grand. Delit sixty three. Gaia forty five. You know, there's, there's some big, big contracts here. I mean. Flanagan takes up one tenth of it on his own. So, Volendam has gone in for him. That's good. That's good. It means he might be going. Should we? You know what? Let's go to general info position. Jorgensen. Off for the clubs. Yeah. You might not like it, but fuck it. I, 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 we need to make money. Office made. 1.9 million, 3.1 million? Eh, nah, mate. Nah, I don't think so, mate. Reject. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't think so. You need, you need to be doing better than that. When a player's worth 8 million, hmm. Nah, I've, 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 I'll take 6.5. Don't get me wrong, I'll take 6.5. But 1.9, 3.1, and they want me to pay 19 grand of his wages? Nah, I don't think so. I don't think so. Uh, Roberta set to sign for Volendam. Django's been extended. Why? Oh, right, yeah, I forgot about him. He's pretty <laughs> He's pretty decent. He's not going to be very, very good for us, though. So he's reasonably decent. Uh, so we've got Dutch Cup quarterfinal final draw after the Vitesse game. We need to do something with regards to getting some silverware this season. Just reader has got a new contract. Always nice. Uh, release clause set at six point seven five. 
higher than previously 3.89 um, yeah there we go that's good that is good it's an improvement I'd rather not have a release clause because I think it's going to be worth more than the 6.25 I don't know I don't know maybe something we can look at in the future um, I'm assuming because he's under a certain age because I, I let our uh, head of youth development sort out the contracts for younger players but yeah anyway if we go back to the Eredivisie I actually got a game in hand and they're on the same amount of points as us we're only one goal behind us and goal difference too so we do need to start looking at getting some wins we need to bring in some sort of players as well I say if we can sell the Jorgensen maybe get someone else in especially if we're going to go with this tactic here we need to see if we can find ourselves a strong attacking midfielder uh, to go alongside obviously Tornstra's there Asensio's there and the Vilhena's there but hopefully we can find someone better than Tornstra to play as a shadow striker in fact before we get into this game let's clear that out of the way let's get some realistic transfers on yeah, none of these are... I mean, if I could have a look at Ryan Edwards. Edwards? Dog shit. Absolute dog shit. I mean, it's like I can't even... I don't know what it is. You can't sign Chinese players on free transfers. I don't know. I, I, I don't know if it's a case of me cocking things up or what. Uh, Shadow Striker. Attack. Okay. Let's get these down to 14. 13. Dennis Glushikov. I've got a few players here. Popov, Alexander Gorgon. So he's Austrian. He's the youngest. This guy, Scott Hogan. Can't play attacking midfield centre, but we'll scout him anyway. Might be able to retrain him. Yeah, 27 though. Uh, Artem Zuber. Sergei Ripalka. Yeah, we'll have a look at him. We'll have a look. Don't mind scouting some of these players. If it means we're going to. Evelyn Popov. Junior Mraz. See, I've heard of him. He's going to be a reasonably affordable player compared to some of the others. Don't know why he keeps doing this. I know the players are there. You know, we've already loaded players in. Stop fucking around with it. Oh, fuck, we'll just do this. Popov. Maybe Gorgon. No. Zuba. Scalia. Or Scalia. Whereas if we then do that we'll add in roll <coughs> can play shadow striker where is the shadow there is or is partially no one Bradley Dack 25 year old Englishman with a cheesy grin We'll scout him. We'll scout him. I don't mind. I mean, he's, he's clearly not going to be an amazing player. But if he's an improvement, what is the issue? I've only picked seven subs. Fuck. Oh, fuck it. Never mind. Doesn't matter. Doesn't matter. We're going to get fucked anyway. No, we're not going to get fucked. We're going to win. We're going to gonna fucking win. Um, Ajax aren't playing. I, I need Ajax to play. They've got two games in hand if they... If they don't play, right? I think we go for a calm. I want you to pick up. Yeah. I go. Um, hmm. Passionate. I have faith in you. I like have. I have faith in you. The thing is, it doesn't seem to be anything else there, apart from I expect everything else seems a little bit wishy washy. I, even I have faith in you seems wishy washy. Me telling them assertively what I want them to do X, Y, Z also seems a bit. Fuck me, my screen is bright and my face is green. I've just noticed. Um, yeah, everything just seems a bit wishy washy when it comes to team talks. Uh, push. F clear selection. Don't want it. It's defensive, isn't it? It's, it's a counter attacking. Tighten up. Okay, tighten up. Hopefully we'll get something out of this. Got two goal, two shots on goal, one on target. They have got fuck all to delit. Tielemans, Fellaini, Wilhelmer, Fellaini with his fucking yellow card already. Asensio, Fellaini, Wilhelmer, Sabali. Come on, let's get a nice crossing. It's a penalty. It's a penalty. 
Who have we got taking the penalty though? Who's number 28? Is that Tielemans? It's Tornstra. Yeah, it's not a bad penalty. Not a bad penalty taker. Puts it away nicely. So that means we're now three points at the top of the league. But Ajax do still have two games in hand. That is that is the problem. The fact they've got these games in hand. Don't need to see a replay for a fucking penalty in this face. It's, it's a penalty. Team talk. No, I won't bother at a minute. Can I steal that ball? Well done. Look, Asensio, I was going to say Asensio. Tornstra was in the middle there. Could have just played it nicely. And another one, look. And another one. Look, that's Asensio. Come on, Asensio. Score. Yeah. Not a bad effort, I guess. Could have been better. Could have cut it inside a little bit earlier and opened up the angle for himself. Tornstra from distance. Go on. Oh, fuck you. Why not? Get reader. He had a decent attempt. Plus, by the way, if you are Dutch, and that's a Dutch name, tell me how to pronounce it. Because I ain't got a fucking clue. Uh, prove a point. Things are going well. You're capable of better. Tina ones didn't seem to like that. No. <laughs> Fuck it. <laughs> uh, some reds. Never mind. Let's get a team talk here and get a passionate concentrate. It's a fairly decent throw forward. Shame no one's on the end of it. Come on, boys. That's it. Nice. Sabali Fellaini. It's a little bit slow on the uh, counter-attack, I think. Might just be me. I think if, we, if it's a counter-attacking tactic, you need to be doing this quickly. It's fine, though. We scored a goal. But you do need to be doing it quickly, don't you? You can't just sort of take your time. Where is someone? Oh, they're there. Which is what Fellaini basically did there in the midfield when he got the ball. But, I mean, ultimately we scored a goal. It's 2 0. I can't argue too much. The result was there. I still can't believe Fellaini's picking up so many fucking. Oh, I can, because it's Fellaini. Picks up yellow cards like fucking candy. Alright. Should we make a quick team talk? Assertive, concentrate. We'll get a sub after this particular highlight. Tornstruck, your treater. I like him. <laughs> I like him a lot. It's two goals in two games. He's, he's going to be a solid player for us. I think he's a youth product as well. It's a nice finish, that. That is a nice finish. Right peg. Yeah. Uh, who should we bring on? Not Jorgensen. Malachi can come on for Sabali. Fellaini for Gustafsson. I, I'm worried about him getting sent off. I will bring Jorgensen on for Tornstra. I don't want to bring Jorgensen on. I want to sell him. But might as well get all the players' yellow cards off the pitch. Don't risk anything, you know. Get a team talk in. Or not. <laughs> I thought it was time for another team talk. Team talk. Let's go. <laughs> uh, show some passion. I don't, know. I don't know. I think if we show some passion, things might go our way. Go on, Reyes. Get that ball back into the middle. That's it. Got some movement. Asensio's open. Asensio's open. Making a break. Just fuck around a bit then. Katrina! Fucking boy. Ah. Oh, I, I, you're going to be so fucking good. Look at you. You are a product of our. No? Yeah, yeah, you are. You're a product of the Youth Academy. Even better. Fantastic. The kind of thing we want to see is young Rotterdam players. Fine, fine odds in Rotterdam, by the way. Young Rotterdam players coming through. Scoring goals. As a wing back. Fucking <laughs> lovely. Next fucking Danny Alves over there. Alright. If we can work with this free kick, maybe the next Roberto Carlos. You never know. What is his free kicks like? We'll have a look in a bit. If his free kicks are semi decent, we might just get him training on free kicks. Let's set them up, line them up. There you go, mate. Knock them in. That is a good win. Well done, lads. Well done, lads. Good win for us. So that does leave us three points clear. They do have. Fuck's sake. Oh, dude. Alright. Uh, don't worry about that. Um, yeah, so we do have three points clear at the top, but. 
I actually have two games in hand. Uh, Tiedemann's Fitness, yeah. I'm a little bit worried about Tiedemann's Fitness as well. But I don't really have anyone else. Gatrida, free kick taking 10. I mean, it's a solid base to start from. It's just... I'd rather work on the other things first. It's training wise. Box to box, passing. Don't worry about that, that's fine. Anyway, guys, I think that's going to be the end of today's episode. So, we've had a couple of good results. So, we look at this Hogan. Actually, before we do anything else, get these all onto Fully Scout and Junior Marais. Could be decent. We'll have a look at him. Let's get, get them all scoured. We'll get them all scoured, that's fine. You're happy with Asensio. I mean, so am I. I mean, look at the guy. Solid as fuck. So good. So good. Everything's decent here, apart from jumping, reach, and balance. But that can be worked on. That's good. Uh, work rate's a little bit poor. Teamwork's a little bit poor. But everything else, I mean, it's going. It's going. It's, he's just basically he's our best player. Without a doubt. So, yeah. I think we've had a, a decent run of form here. We beat Benfica 2-1. Uh, be Addo Den Haag 4 0. And I think what we'll do for the next episode, uh, we'll probably come in with Vitesse and Ajax. I think that's a decent one to come in on. The Ajax game would definitely be one of the bigger games of the season. So we beat them 4 0 the last time around, too. So yeah, this one's away. Anyway, guys, if you have enjoyed today's episode, of course, please do like and subscribe. Check me out on uh, Twitter. Um, I will, I will announce on Twitter roughly when I'm going to do streams. I won't put anything directly in the Twitch um, schedule thing. Um, it's just be a case of as and when, partly because of the work hours I do. But hopefully I'll see you in the stream. And if not, I'll see you when I see you. Take care.